Hi Pelican Sound, this is Tim Harris, your head golf professional, uh, here to talk to you today about our new cart staging area that just opened up and wanted to talk to everyone about some do's and don'ts as far as traffic flow and how we can navigate ourselves around this area now that we are open. Our starter is back in the starter's booth over here behind me. Um, so when you check in, the bag drop is now back to its original location. Uh, the cart guys and all the bag staff will be out there to assist you with your bags. Um, I want to make sure everyone understands because it is a much more open area than it used to be. There's no more of the dividers and the trees getting in the way to kind of restrict traffic flow. Um, we have some very pronounced brick pavers that kind of define the areas that you're supposed to drive in. Um, so for main traffic flow coming to and from the golf courses, especially maybe coming off of the Lakes 9 over here and heading out over to the river into the sound courses, uh, Kurt over here is going to be coming uh, along and you're going to see that he's going to keep his cart within the pronounced uh, brick paver area. That's where we want the traffic flow to go as he's making his way over to River 1 or to Sound 1. Um, you can see that the lines here define where he wants to travel and as he continues on he's going out towards River 1 and Lakes 1. What we don't want is we don't want people cutting across the brick paver on lines, kind of like what you see this gentleman doing here, how he's cutting through there. When we are at our busiest times, and you can see how this gentleman here is kind of cutting through, when we're at our busiest times, it's going to be filled with a lot of carts. It's going to be filled with a lot of people. There's going to be a lot of traffic in this area. So we can get everybody to kind of stay inside the lines as they're going to and from the different courses. That could work out the best. Uh, as far as our driving range, we're going to be on the mats here for the foreseeable future. Um, strictly because when we were using this area for our cart staging, it worn down the turf quite a bit. Um, it got the turf to be really uh, muddy and dry. So we're going to try to give the driving range a little bit of a break and we're going to be on the mats. So this area that you see that I'm standing in right now is going to be used for cart parking. So when you come in, you park your carts. Um, here's the defined line that we want the traffic flow going through. But on the other side here, you see how these carts are parked here going up towards the range. That's where we want you to park your cart when you're using the driving range. And as best as you can, our superintendent has left some openings on the uh, ropes. We uh, put our little stanchions right over here to kind of define the area where we want you to go through to get make your way up onto the driving range. We do have some freshly laid sod that is down here and we're trying to minimize the amount of foot traffic that goes onto that sod. So if you can just take your time when you park your cart and then maybe just look for the opening in the ropes to where you want to enter and exit when you're going to use the driving range, we would much appreciate it. Um, <clears throat> as uh, just to reiterate that down this way, the golf carts are going to be staged down towards the bag drop uh, area. So when the carts are staged there, and you come up this way, check in with the starter, and then make your way over here to the parking area when you park your cart to hit some balls and get ready for your tee time. Um, but I think the main thing is that we just want to preach safety as always. We want everyone to be careful when they're driving around the area. We're still under construction here at the clubhouse. So you see how the fence is always going to be up there. It's going to be up there for the remainder of the project until it's done. So navigating your way down towards lakes number one, if you're going to lakes one, it can be a little bit tight in areas. We are going to put some speed bumps in that uh, area down there towards the chipping green. So we make sure people slow down and there is some narrow areas down that way. So we just want to make sure when there is two-way traffic going there way that you do slow down, you take your time, use caution when you're driving in that area. And then in this area around the, the uh, cart staging, try to stay within the pronounced lines of the brick pavers. That's going to help traffic flow going to and from the golf courses and also minimize any type of uh, accidents that might happen if you're out into the open area. So we're excited, uh, progress is happening. We hope you enjoy it uh, when you're out in this area. It is a much larger space. Um, so we uh, are really anticipating a great season, uh, looking forward to uh, the clubhouse being open and hopefully before too long. But until that time comes, be careful around this area. Do your best to uh, watch out for traffic and be safe. Thanks everyone for taking the time.